Knitting techniques. The knit return, pass return, decrease. English style. To download a guide with our five favorite tips to improve your knitting right now, visit newstitchaday.com slash five knit tips. For this tutorial, you'll need the following materials. A pair of knitting needles, a cable needle or a double pointed needle, and a ball of yarn. A special thanks to our sponsor Lion Brand for providing today's yarn. Today we are using their Lion's Pride Wool Spun, available exclusively at Michael's Craft Stores and lionbrand.com. In the color, taupe. The knit return, pass return decrease, besides having a long name, is a variation of a right-leaning decrease. Now, if you're left-handed, this will obviously lean left, but this would be a substitution for a knit two together. Is it better than the knit two together? I don't necessarily think it's better or worse. Um, some people would suggest that this matches more closely some of the left-leaning decreases that you would do like a slip knit pass or a slip slip knit um, but it's really up to you to do experiment you're probably not going to see this referred to in any pattern um, it's really up to your discretion to substitute this technique for a knit two together so let me show you how we do this Okay, so just like the name implies, we are going to knit the first stitch for step one. Then we're going to, for step two, return this stitch to our main needle. For step three, we are going to pass the second stitch over the first stitch on our main needle. And for step four, we're going to return that first stitch back to our working needle. Okay? Now, just in case I did that a little bit too fast for you, let's do it once more. So, the first step, we're going to knit the next stitch. Then we're going to pass that stitch back over to our main needle. Then we will pass this second stitch over the first stitch. Like so. And finally, we'll return the knitted stitch back to our working needle. Okay, and there we go. That's how we do the knit return, pass return, decrease. Hey, I'm Johnny Vasquez, founder of New Stitch A Day and your teacher for this tutorial. I want to thank you so much for taking the time to learn from us. If you'd like to see more videos just like this, we produce new content every single day. Hence, New Stitch A Day. You can click the subscribe button so that you don't miss a single stitch. And if you click one of the links to the side here, you can see the previous stitch in our series or the next stitch in our series. And if you click this link, you'll be able to see one of my favorites. And don't forget, you can also download a PDF with the written instructions for this tutorial by clicking or using the URL link that's on the screen. Again, I want to thank you so much for learning with us, and I hope that we've helped make your knitting and crochet skills a little bit better today. Yarn on.